Verify the identity cosecant squared x cosine squared x is the same as cosecant squared x minus 1. This is where I start out with the left side. I do a little math trickery to see if I can end up with something on the right side. A um, couple ways you could approach this. I mean, some people might look at cosecant squared x and do something with the 1 plus cotangent squared x, but I'm not going to do that because I don't think that's going to help me here. So instead, what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn cosecant squared x into what its actual version is, 1 over sine squared x. Okay, that's going to be multiplied to cosine squared x. And now I have myself like a little fraction looking thing. Now what this fraction looking thing actually is, is cosine squared x over sine squared x. That is the same exact thing as cotangent squared x. Why? Because cos over sine is cotangent, so two coses over two sines is two cotangents, right? So now that I have that, I know that cotangent squared x is the same as cosecant squared x minus 1 because of the Pythagorean theorem identity, which is what I wanted to get all along. Look at that, I did it.